Welcome to the Making of Art at the Millard Sheets Gallery. Hi, I'm BJ Lane. Have you ever wanted to learn a new medium? As a multidisciplinary artist, I'm always looking for new and exciting ways to share my ideas. In this demonstration, I'm sharing with you what I've learned about encaustics during my five weeks as a guest artist in the Millard Sheets Gallery. Encaustic paints are made of wax, resin, and pigment. Once the wax and resin are heated, powdered pigments or dried out oil paints are added. Basic tools include a hot griddle, muffin tin, or small metal containers, a palette knife, and hair brushes. Additional supplies might include sculpture tools and clips to hold hot containers of paint. Each layer of wax needs to be heated in order to bond with the one underneath. I use both an iron and a heat gun to heat each layer. With encaustics, you need to choose a solid surface to paint on. I chose a wood panel, coated it with gesso, and then applied a thin layer of beeswax and resin. Then. I used my heat gun to even out the layers. I better put this back on. You see, just taking it off my griddle for a little while, it's already gotten my, uh, my little muffin tin full of, of paints have gotten hard. Look at that. As I wait for my wax paint to reheat, I begin planning out my composition. In this painting, I decide to divide the canvas into thirds, both vertically and horizontally. Now it's time to study my subject. This time, I have a live model to work from. I hope you've enjoyed seeing this brief demonstration. I learned a lot using this ancient Egyptian painting medium, and I hope you did too. And next year, I hope to see you at the LA County Fair as I demonstrate oil bars and mixed medium. See you soon.